Hello my friends, this is Shrek the Winner Gamer and we're back again with uh, Create Me A Class. Today's video is coming from St. Lucifer MW3 so thank you for the class setup and just quickly this is part of his class setup I used to my complete advantage. Millimeter scanner, have a look through the wall, sniper, hang on, I get him, I get him in the end, <laughs> you can see him there through the wall. <laughs> okay and he's dead, okay. So, St. Lucifer, MW3, big shout out to you, thank you for the class setup, um, as I've just said. So, his class setup, I'll just run through it quickly. We have the PDW57 with quick draw and the millimeter scanner. Hang on, jump off topic. Tactical insertion, triple kill feed bonanza. <laughs> right, okay, so PDW57 guys with the millimeter scanner and quick draw. Uh, only perks. Um, on the rest of the, the weapon, don't have any lethals or anything like that, any grenades. We have the Hardline, Blind Eye, Scavenger, Engineer and Dexterity. So all in all, a, a pretty good class setup. And the pair, uh, the score streaks we're using, the Visa, the Dogs and the Swarm. And let me point out, I played, I think it was yesterday, so it was Wednesday, I played, no joke, probably about... 20 to 25 games Hardcore Kill confirmed and I couldn't get a visa to save my life. I was raging Like a bitch. I'm not joking. I think because the, the downfall to this class is the millimeter scanner I know it is pretty cool. It's pretty good But on the PDW I don't like it. I prefer it on a more of an assault rifle kind of weapon where you are kind of taking your time. You know when I'm rocking the PDW I want to be in your faces and stuff and the, the millimeter scanner doesn't really help um, too much. But all in all it's still a really good class setup. The perks and everything are really good. Um, it's basically a class setup that I would use myself on a regular basis like, like I said apart from millimeter scanner. Uh, but all in all, very good. So the gameplay, of course, uh, we obviously completed the Create Me A Class, and that's why the video is always being posted. I won't post your class setup until I complete the goal of whatever the score streaks are. Um, so obviously if you say get a swarm, then I need to get the swarm before I obviously post the video. So I think this will probably be a weekly um, series, I'll just do one a week because um, I've got a couple of setups which is going to be almost impossible to get a swarm but I'm determined and this is a, my first swarm fail got the dogs, all I had to do was shoot that guy, I was stupid enough to call the dogs in um, and I died so I was silly. So this could have been a double swarm if I just killed that guy so that would have been even more epic so I almost got a double swarm but I do get the swarm, I get there <coughs> excuse me, sorry uh, so, what was I saying? I forget. Um, hell, I, just, I team killed that guy. I was just on a rampage. I was like, screw it. I'm just going crazy. Because I was so disappointed when I got that. Because I think because I'm trying to do this for you guys. Well, I know every gameplay I do it for, obviously, everyone who watches my stuff. But when someone gives me a suggestion of what to do, when I go and try to do it, I'm trying like super hard. Because they they're giving me like a personal kind of challenge for me to do, and this weapon, you know, it's it's a common weapon that I use. So I actually thought when I set the class up, I was like, this is actually going to be quite easy. But there was just I felt there was like a, a such an overload of pressure just because someone suggested this to me. So it was like, right, I need to do it. I need to make it. I need to do it well. I need to not just scrape by and get the thing just. But this video kind of did that, you know, I'd see I get, when I uh, get my next set of dogs, I just start camping. I <laughs> just lie in a corner and just let my dogs do the work because I was really disappointed when I got killed after the dogs. I thought once I get that swarm, that's me, fantastic, it's brilliant. Uh, but, you know, I kind of folded, so I just I felt like this. It was just a lot of pressure on myself and I was like really nervousy feeling and everything. It's like when you're going for like a Moab or something like that. It's like you just get that sweaty, nervous feeling and it's like, right, come on, come on, come on. You can do it, you can do it. So I got my dogs there, I called the dogs in, I was like, right, screw it. The VSAT was still in the air, but it just goes away. Um, so I was like, oh no, right, I'm just lying down, screw it, lying down. <laughs> so I just lay here. I was like, screw it, I'm letting my dogs get the kills and let the, I had a couple of visa assists, I was like, right, guys, just confirm the tags. But during this game, I checked the scoreboard when I'm lying here, 
And uh, the, we were at 91 points, so I was like, we don't have long left if my dogs are getting killed, so I was like, I'm going to have to push out and try and get a kill somehow. So I do see a guy coming past this doorway, and I just say, uh, fuck it, I'm going for it. <laughs> I'm going for it, I, ho I just hope for the best. <laughs> so I see him running past, so I go, oh, right, I was like, here I go, screw it. I thought he was going to come running, I thought he was sitting in the corner, but someone else my team killed him, so it was a free tag for me. Called the swarm in, got the swarm, created me a class. Saint Lucifer MW3 edition complete. Thank God. I won't be using the millimeter scanner again <laughs> on the on the uh, PDW, but it was still it was really good. It was a good class. It was a good challenge for myself. Um, and if you have any more suggestions, uh, let me know. As I say, I'm going to make this just a weekly series, uh, just because it's quite tricky. Um, some of the classes are quite difficult. So I shall see you in the next video, my friends. Like the video if you did. Adios, amigos.